Pro's Tip, presented by Pelagic High Performance Offshore Gear, official apparel of Florida Sport Fishing TV. Hey guys, welcome to this episode's Pro's Tip. I want to talk to you a little bit about the different ways that we're targeting these peacocks here. We're down in South Miami fishing this canal system. It's rare that you see us fish in fresh water, but this is the exception. These peacock bass are really exotic. They're from the Amazon, aggressive, colorful, and just a ton of fun to catch. We've spent most of the morning sight fishing. You've watched us work the entire perimeter of these lakes. Carlos has been up on the polling platform. I've been up on the bow, and we're spotting these fish right, just right up on the bank, cruising the shoreline and just picking them off one after another, a ton of fun. But there's certainly gonna be times when you can't sight fish. Maybe you've got cloud cover, maybe you've got wind and there's ripples on the surface and you're not able to really see the fish. And that's when you want to turn to some of the deeper parts of the lake. You know, these fish are still here. They didn't go anywhere, that's for sure. But they'll stage at different depths throughout the day and in different conditions. So it's a good idea to be able to really cover all of the bases. Now remember, you're going to need a variety of baits because when you're fishing for these fish up on the bank, when you're sight fishing them, you're really only in a matter of inches of water, maybe a foot, two feet at the very most. But when you're out here fishing these deeper areas, you know, these lakes were cut out 50, 60 years ago. They average five to 10 feet deep. You're gonna need some baits that penetrate the depths. You know, you're gonna need some lures that can get down two to four feet below the surface. And then you're gonna need some lures that can get down maybe five to eight feet below the surface. Right now I'm throwing a little Rapala scatter wrap. It's got a really erratic action. And this baby, you know, depending on how fast you crank it, We'll get down five, six feet below the surface. Just an awesome, awesome bait. And I'll tell you, you don't have to come out here with a thousand different lures, but make sure that you've got a variety of different baits for the different depths and at least a couple of different patterns in each lure. That's really all that you need. You know, some surface lures, some poppers, or maybe some prop baits, because you'll catch these fish up on top. They'll come up and just crush top orders. They really will. Really exciting stuff. And then, you know, have some lures that you can fish, as I mentioned earlier, a couple of feet below the surface, all the way on down to five or eight feet below the surface. So some suspending baits, some sinking baits, some floating baits. And this way you can cover all of the bases and make sure that you maximize on every opportunity. The same applies, you know, here in these canals down in South Miami or anywhere else throughout Dade, Broward, Palm Beach, where you'll find these peacock bass. There's a wide variety of ponds, lakes, canal systems. You know, and, and the approach is the same everywhere. You can sight fish them or you can fish them in deeper water, but make sure you're ready. And remember, if you don't have a bait in the water, you'll never catch them.